Woohoo! So excited! Finally gonna fix the Y wiggle. The Y wobble. Almost finished printing. Hopefully, what's gonna be the final re resolution to the Y wobble. Woohoo! Can't wait! Let's go! Print faster! Awesome! That looks like they're done now. So, hopefully, we can get rid of. Some of this wobble, eh? So here they are. That goes up that way. And the other one is basically the same. And we put a nut and a bolt through it. Like that. Oops, like that. And that goes on the bottom. Those holes there are for the normal screw heads which go onto the bearings slash wheels and this allows us to screw it together. Yes! Awesome! And that should stop the wheels from going and then the top of them going if you've got an adjustable width at the top of them. And of course this means that we can adjust it without dismantling anything we just need to screw up the screw or loosen that screw to adjust the amount of torque on it and hopefully that will be the end of Y Wobbles. Let's find out. Okay, people, there we have it. They are installed now. And you can see all that wobble. Crazy wobble. This is really the noticeable part, though. Well, that's more noticeable, but this is the indication of the problem. So let's do those uh, bolts up. Here we go. No more wobble. Yeehaw. Yeehaw. Obviously still has a bit of flex because it's at the end of the day one support in the middle. But it is a thousand times better. And there's no more tension problems. Probably needs to be a bit tighter. Tighter. And look how easy it is to do. You can do with it on. You don't have to flip it up like this. But obviously we can't see it in the video. I think that is fixed finally. Woohoo! No more wobbly lines on prints anymore. More. No more shaggy dog prints. And something that's relatively easy to make and install. 40 millimeter long M5 bolts going through here. Not crazy massive heads like these ones. And these can be 65 millimeters long or longer. These are longer, they are M5s as well. Uh, lock nut bolts in there are the best idea, though those aren't because I didn't have any. But I should get those. So hopefully that is the end of that problem. And if you have the auto leveling one, don't forget to hard mount the, the head bed to the plastic acrylic frame for greater rigidity because of course the springs just add more place for flex and floppiness which we're trying to resume re yeah, trying to re remove can't even say it so hopefully that is the end of that you guys can download this from thingiverse if you like this video like this video if you dislike this video like it anyway if you don't want to subscribe well don't and if you do you probably already have uh we will see you on the next one guys bye bye